All right, this is uh, Bondino Bond 9429. Just a good view of the street. Pretty clean. Much better than the other one, uh, Golden Trumpet one, which is nearby, but this is a, a little bit nicer setup, I think. Uh, this one needs some exterior paint as well. It's not in bad shape. It's just just faded a little bit um, Front porch This one has been renovated to a degree um, Although cheaply as usual corporate owned property um, Carpets all new paints new Smells like new carpet. It's bright in here, which is great. Uh, high ceilings. This one does back up to a road, which I'll show you in a minute. So you will have that to consider. It wouldn't deter me from buying the house, but everyone's got their own, you know, thing they gotta look at in terms of value. This flooring is hideous. It's just ugly. I mean, I don't know what they were thinking there. Really, really not nice looking flooring. Um, but every house we've seen, honestly, is needed flooring, essentially, to some degree or another. So, again, that's a personal preference to determine. But this is a nice open space here. Um, appliances are new, the ones they have, no fridge. Um, so here is like a elevated dining room, and you got your little your living room lower. And then we come over here, you got another family room space here. And the master bedroom is downstairs in this house. Double sinks. Nice high high vanity, which is good. It's got the separate tub and shower. A little commode over there. Nice big walk-in closet. A little linen closet. Um, over here we've got a little powder room, actually large, big, huge powder room. Uh, powder room there with the same ugly flooring. Laundry room right here. In the garage, which is three car garage. Nice size garage. Let's check out the outside and then we'll go upstairs. Cool. All right, so backyard clean, barbecue looks ancient, fire pit, uh, pool, it's okay. It looks like they probably have a pump issue or autofill issue because the spa is low. So, you have a street behind you. So you'll have a little bit of road noise for sure. I would say it's immediate, um, um, intermediate road noise. So if road noise bothers you, don't, don't buy this house for sure. But you know, the advantage of that is you get nobody behind you, which is great for privacy. And like right now, yeah, nice views of the blue Vegas sky. All right, let's check out the upstairs. I like the nice wide uh, stairwell here. Something of a pet peeve of mine on two-story houses. Um, so that's good, it makes it easier to get furniture upstairs. Again, all this carpet's brand new. If you don't like carpet, which I don't like carpet, it wouldn't matter to me, but if you like carpet, then it's, it's great because it's a lot of, less of it and it's all been painted, freshly painted too. They did not change it when the light fixtures are all older there's a nice loft here see nice views here you can see the views of mount charleston you can see a strip from here too a little bit nothing to write home about but it is a nice view out the back this glass uh sort of a loft area here no idea i mean i guess it could be a studio or an office, maybe. 
Interesting. Looks like that's what they were trying to make it into at some point. And then we got a nice big bed. All the bedrooms are very large. It's a big house. The bedrooms are big. This one's big. It's very bright. It's the reason I wanted to take a look at this one. Uh, I'm sorry. You, know, you want to see the bathroom here. Single thing in this bathroom. This is kind of tough. dated. And then tub and shower combo. And then we got the last two bedrooms down here. Again, very large bedrooms. You know, I actually really like this house. The only thing I don't like about it is the street behind it. If it wasn't for a street behind it, I'd, I'd, it'd probably all be sold. And I actually would be a, uh, it would be a slam dunk to some degree. I mean, they, the flooring is an issue, but you're gonna have that in every house to a degree. And really, if you don't mind uh, carpeting, it's like two rooms that have that really ugly tile. And I think you might, unless you like it, which you might actually, I should say that. Some people like different things. But um, if I were buying the house, I'd take all the flooring out. Spend the 20 grand and do like a modern, more modern flooring throughout the house, new light fixtures. And then it's already painted, so that's good. And it'll look much more modern 